hello and welcome back to my channel i want to show you my latest project it's a little bit delay i know it's a christmas album and it is made with this beautiful paper collection from lexi design cinnamon christmas i have this one um for a longer time and every year i put this out of my stash and uh, i thought yeah let me do an album but then there was another beautiful paper and I put it back in my stash. But this year it is the time to use this beautiful paper and the end result looks like this. This is a really fat and thick album with a nice and fluffy decoration here on my spine with a little dangle and on the back side it looks like this the measurements are um this was uh, nine and three quarters no just a second no this was a nine and a half by nine and a quarter and the spine was um yeah a four and three quarters so like i said we have here a beautiful beautiful fluffy fabric decoration here on my spine i had to cover up my um, spine here on the banding points because the cardstock I use is not strong enough for yeah for a cover so I had here crackles all over the whole size so I covered this one up I put some um, bookbinders linen under to give them more strength and then I covered this again with these beautiful fluffy fabric the cover is a little bit of yeah a mixed media i put here some trees um this is made from a sisix dye and a no-name dye i don't know where i get this from and i put on some um paste and some drips and drops with acrylic paint and on the back side it's the same here with some paste and here the trees and the drops with the acrylic paint on the spine i have here again a sisix dye and some cut out pieces and here i put some rhinestones on and here a little star for a christmas tree so let's go inside we have a ribbon closure and then we open this you see it's really really full packed and um, i had to make on all of my pages some protection sheets because there is a lot going on on the pages on the outsides here on the front cover we have some tags and two pockets i made here from these uh, cut out pieces some tags or some journaling spots here we have a picture mat here are some of these tags and here also a little picture mat on page number one I'll try to bring you this a little bit closer This is a magnetic closure and we can open this. Inside of here we have two picture mats and this we can open like this. And we have here place for more pictures. Here I have some decoration with uh, some uh, uh, flat back pearls the main pages 
all of my four main pages has um, on the side a picture mat and I made here a little decoration with some lace and some charms. So page number two is this one. Here again a decoration with these flat back pearls and we have a ribbon closure. Here a nice decoration with some cutouts, a little bit of a three-dimensional. Then we can open this and this is actually, this is in the original um, a greeting card, but I made here a fold out for pictures. This is really, really big. I have to try this, bring you this in frame. And this is the closure. So next page, page number three. is this one, protection sheet. Here we have a frame for a picture. We can open this. Here you have again place for a nice picture and here you can put a picture under. Then we can open this to the side. Here is a nice little pocket with a picture mat. Here is a little pocket with a little booklet and we can open this one again. Here again, same as this side, a little pocket with a little booklet. Here you have place for a nice picture and then you can open this one again. A big pocket with some picture mats inside and here this is also three-dimensional there is a little tuck spot for two simple picture mats and two tags here inside and this is all layered on chipboard um, three-dimensional with some stickles and some of these flat back pearls so next page page number four <coughs> is this one we can open this place for some pictures careful here with my punch and this we can open <coughs> sorry and here inside we have some pockets in the back side this is a bigger pocket I made here these nice booklet for some pictures So then we have here a smaller one, nice charms on it, and here you can place a picture. And in the front there is a little shaker and also booklet for three, four or three pictures. This goes back inside of here. Page number five, again a protection sheet. We have here also a shaker. I hope you can see this. And this is a magnetic closure. 
and this opens like this place for pictures and you can flip this again place for pictures like this first time I did this yeah it's okay I'm it, it could be a little bit better but it's okay for the first time for the first try it's for me fine so next page page number six is a door page with a string closure we can open this one here we have two pockets here you have place for some pictures and here in the pockets are some tags place for some pictures then you can open this one again like this picture picture here you have some flaps for pictures and that's not all if you turn this to the side you have here also place for some pictures and on this side is the same more place for two pictures everything closes here magnetic and this one here closes with the string closure page number seven is again a little um, shaker here this you can open to the side place for some pictures you can open this one again and you can flip this to the top you can flip this to the bottom nice place for pictures then we have here again some flaps to the side and we have a waterfall so there is place for let me count this one two three four five maybe here six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve forty fifty sixty 70, 18, 90, maybe t t uh, up to 20 pictures you can put all here in this one in this one um, page. So then page number eight, the last in the album. I have to make this a little bit more easier to use for me. Here we have some belly bands. Like this with a booklet. This is made of all my leftovers. Place for some pictures inside. Oopsie, this is the back side. And the same on here. A little booklet. Place for some pictures. And we have here a waterfall. This one closes magnetic and the booklets also holds magnetic here on my belly bands that nothing can fall or slip out of the book. Holds nicely in place. And this is the last page. There are two pockets with two picture mats or two booklets. This also here. This is a little booklet. And here we have four tags. So I had to check something because I guess I have forgot to show you one page. 
page. Yeah, you see, I forget this. Ah, on page number two, we had here these um, fold out card, but that's not all because we can flip this again here to the side place for some pictures. Here we have two incision cuts with two um, places for some tags and we have here inside again we have a waterfall for pictures and here underneath a little tag spot with these picture mat. So I forget this to show you. But you will see this all in the tutorials. So we close this with a nice bow. Like this. And this is my little Christmas album. I hope you like this and give me a thumbs up. I will see you on the tutorials and on my next project. Bye bye!